Arctic Fox, baby. That is a blue back uh, smelt pattern fly, and uh, that was my fourth hit. But uh, that's the hit that counted right there. Look at that trout. That's a dandy rainbow. Not the biggest rainbow we've gotten out of this lake by any means, but that is a that is a handsome fat fish. What do you think, Lou? <laughs> Lou doesn't think much, Bobby. But anyway, that'll be a nice addition to the stringer. Wow, what a beautiful fish. That fish was five feet deep and I was trolling right at about 1.4 miles an hour. So a little surface chop, ideal conditions for running a fly just under the surface and uh, Hey, paid off. I'm not complaining. Look at that. <laughs> cool. Here's a tip I got from a bass guy that was also a Lorance rep and, uh, you know, a total expert on Lorance fish finders. We were out at Lake Pardee and uh, it, was, it was glassy. And uh, there was a little bit of disturbance showing on top of the sonar unit screen. And I asked him, you know, what is that? And he says, well, that's, that's current created by, you know, this little bit of breeze. I was like, really? He said, oh, yeah, that's current. He said, see those marks down there at 20, 25 feet? I said, yeah, you know, those are trout. Okay. He said, you watch this afternoon when the wind comes up a little bit, that surface disturbance is going to increase. And he said, you watch and see, those trout are going to pull right up into that surface disturbance, into that current, because rainbow trout love current. Well, I've always remembered that. A lot of times I'll be out in a power boat, we'll be catching fish at 25, 30 feet. That breeze will come up and I actually go shallower. Follow the fish up in the water column. They'll pull up into that current. Rainbows, they're stream fish, you know? That's in their genes. They wanna be in that current. They wanna orient to it. They wanna get their head into the current. So remember that when the wind comes up, Whatever level you've been fishing at, oftentimes you can come up shallower and continue catching fish. 